Passion isn't just a sexual thing. It's like a drive, something that comes from within. It, it makes you do what you want to do and want it desperately and then try to do it the best that you can. It's everything. It's like ordering food at a restaurant and you know that anticipation and that waiting that you're like, oh my God, this food and you're watching the waiters walk by with different people's dishes and, and every one of those dishes could be yours and you're just waiting. I mean, that's what passion gives you, that, that want, that, that excitement, that anticipation. I mean, you could carry that to every part of your life and make your entire life uh, exciting and an adventure. Well, I'm gonna try to do it. So it's like your whipped cream to your dessert. You know, everybody likes whipped cream. <laughs> Hi, I'm Maite, and I'm the author of the book, Sortera. Sometimes when things don't work out, they actually end up working out for the best. I welcome you and your friends to my world of Sortera. This is our time. This is the yummy kind of passion, where you have a connection with a person that you can't stop thinking about. You think about them all day, kissing you, touching you, caressing you. Then you see them and you can't keep your hands off one another. I mean, you could see them across the room and your eyes will connect and the sparks will fly. No words are necessary, it's on. I mean, this kind of connection is special. It's like a spiritual thing. It enhances all your senses, all your emotions, and when you're with them, you're the happiest. I mean, if you have a fight with them, they make you angrier than anybody else instantly. I mean, you could cry about them or with them. You could laugh. I mean, it's amazing. So if you come across one of these, enjoy it for what it is because it doesn't happen often and it's totally worth every second. There are so many things to be passionate about. I mean, I'm a Latina, so I'm passionate by nature, but for example, me. After I got divorced, I got in touch with being outside. I love it. I love walking, running, sports. I have a convertible. It's not a midlife crisis. It's just another way of being in touch with nature. You know, uh, I like writing outside. I actually can't write unless I'm on the street. It's really weird. I hate being behind closed doors when I do it. I mean, some people are passionate about their bodies. You know, their bodies, their temple. They're very picky about what they eat. They work out all the time. It could be passion about learning, teaching. I mean, some men, sports, cars, women, and men, shopping. The point is, is that having passion for it is being all in. So it's a different level of enjoyment. I mean, you, you eat it, you breathe it, you want it. So, I mean, that's really how you should like things because you get all that you can out of it. So if you're not doing it, I highly recommend it. I mean, I'm sure you're doing it already. Just get passionate. Yeah, let's do it. Passion lives in here. It's a desire to live life fully. It eliminates fear and it's what makes life delicious. It's like, it's like a scratch to a big itch. You know, if you haven't tapped into it, you're really missing out because it's the difference between an extraordinary life and just like a daily routine. Mojo is what keeps us going. So, but watch out, because once you wake up the beast, it's on. If you all like this episode, please like and subscribe. I hope you have an amazing week and I'll talk to you all really soon. Bye.